Hey, what's going on out there, everybody? Rooster here in Tennessee. Going to do a video for you today. Looking at a Galaxy DX949 over here on the left and a RM Italy 203, KL203 over here on the right. And uh, that's what we're going to be focusing on is the amplifier. We just decided to use this radio to test uh, this and the 959. Pretty popular radios out there. Uh, people like them. A uh, couple of uh, under $200 radios. Um, and this one hasn't had anything done to it. It's, it's basically stock, and I figured it would be a good radio, good candidate to use to test this little 203 out here and uh, show you what this thing's capable of with a stock radio. Uh, sideband hasn't been tuned up. AM hasn't been tuned up. As far as I know, uh, both are stock. So uh, anyway, we're going through our little RM Italy here. Let's show you what the 949 is doing. Uh, we've got a 50 watt slug over here in the bird. That's going to be the middle scale. RF power is turned all the way down. Oh, we got our amp on. Hold on here. Let's turn the amp off first. All right, let's try that again. Okay, so that's about three watts of a uh, dead key. And uh, we'll see what it does. Average power just for kicks. Hello. About four and a half, five watts average. Uh, let's go to peak. Hello, one, two, one, two, audio, one, two, audio, one, two, audio, one, two, audio, one, two. Not even 25 watts uh, peak. All right. So uh, let's go over here to sideband. Now, sideband, we're going to run our RF power up because this is a stock radio hasn't been modified to, to do full output uh, with the carrier down so the RF power actually controls the forward forward output power as well so uh, let's test it on sideband here hello audio one two one two one two one two one two audio not even 20 watts let's see we'll go back to AM Turn our RF power all the way back down because we don't want to key too much into our little RM Italy here. Uh, what we'll do is we'll pop out this 50 watt slug. And we'll put in our, let me see that, 500 watt slug. So we're going to be reading the same scale except 50 is going to be 500 now. Uh, let's see, we'll do average, well, we, we're still on peak so we'll just do peak power first. Come down here, turn our little RM Italy on, and we're reading peak power now. About a 50 watt carrier, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, about 190 watts peak. Audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, one, two, three, audio. That's uh, just about, 100% forward modulation, dead key in 50, swing in 200. Uh, we'll check it on average. Let's see. Then we'll go to sideband. Uh, average power. Audio. Audio. Basically just standing still on average. Audio. Audio. Audio, one, two, one, two, one, two, audio, one, two, audio. Might be backing up just a shade on average power, uh, but about 50 watts average. Now, uh, what we'll do is we'll go to sideband. Uh, we're going to crank our RF power up all the way here. We're going to go to sideband mode here. Uh, we'll go back to peak here. And let's do uh, output test. Hello, one two, one two, one two, one two, one two. Audio, 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 audio. About 175 or 180 on sideband. And uh, you know we're putting a little bit less into it too. The 949 did 20 watts on sideband, about 23 or 24 on AM peak power. I had a guy on here the other day said something silly on YouTube. He commented on my video of the 203P 
And he said, oh, don't listen to this guy. You put 10 watts into this thing, you'll blow it up. Nobody ever said to put 10 watts of dead key into one of these, okay? I don't know where the misconception is, uh, but two to three watts of dead key is what you want to put into these. You know, 20 watts, 30 watts, uh, peak power, AM or sideband, it doesn't matter. Uh, peak power is peak power. Uh, you know, on AM, you just need to watch your carrier, uh, your dead key, and make sure it doesn't go over two to three watts. I'd say about three watts is about max. Uh, I think that's about what we were putting into it. Three, three and a half, and we were getting about 100% forward swing on it. So, uh, anyway, guys, that's the RM Italy KL203. I've got some of these in stock. We'll continue to have these in stock. Uh, gonna get some more 503s. Gonna get some more 300s. Uh, gonna get some more 203Ps. But I figured I'd get some of these 203s. Do the same thing as a 203P. Just doesn't have a sideband. Or it doesn't have a preamp. That's it, guys. DX949. Stock radio. Going into a RM Italy KL203. Hope you guys enjoy. See you, bye. Questions, comments, complaints, 423-299-3535. Send me a text message. I'll catch you guys out there. Bye-bye-bye.